there. I'm glad you were able to come over. Don't worry about it. I wasn't too busy. I'm glad I... I'm glad you came down. I heard that you were having a little bit of trouble with some stuff. Mm-hmm. You seem a little sad on the phone. Well, you could talk about it with me while we're here. Does that make you feel a little better? <laughs> There's Nira. Do you want to see her? Okay. Why don't you come see her before you sit down? Come on this way. She's right over here. Yeah. There she is. <laughs> I always like petting her. If I'm worried or stressed, she's a good kitten. Good girl. <laughs> you want to take a closer look? Yeah. Maybe you can hear her breathing. Sorry if you can hear my neighbors. They're a little bit loud. The cars outside are loud too. She's so soft. <laughs> yeah, good girl. <laughs> down? Okay. So let's go and sit down. Okay. Why don't you take a seat right here? Okay? There you go. How's that? So, did you want to tell me a little bit about what's been going on? Some people in your life have been making you feel kind of sad and you know, shh, 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 shh. Mm -hmm. and other people maybe being a little mean. Yeah, yeah, I know it's hard. And I know it might seem like there's not a lot of good people in the world, but there are. They're out there. <laughs> She's worried about you. Mm hmm You know, here, I'm gonna pick her up. Or she wants to sit over there. <laughs> okay. You know, when I was little, I was bullied in school. Mm hmm A lot of people, they just... Some of them were mean and others were just didn't want me around and I didn't know why. But it did get better. things you can do is, if you have people in your life, maybe friends, especially friends, who are making you feel bad, and are maybe not the greatest people to have around, not really bringing any positivity into your life, I know maybe you might want to hang on to them because you think it's better than being alone, but think of it that they're taking up time and space in your life. And then there's no more space or time for what you do want. A lot of times, we'll hang on to things we don't want because it's better than nothing. Then there's no room for the things that we do want. Yeah. So if you only accept good people into your life, eventually that's what you'll end up with. 
because you won't accept anything else. Mm -hmm. I know it's hard. I have a lot of good friends now, though, so... <laughs> she, wants to, she wants to sit on your lap, I think. Whoa! <laughs> She's shaking the chair. Yeah, so I know it's tough. Mm -hmm. And you feel like sometimes even random strangers are just not nice and it gets you down? Yeah. I have trouble with that too, carrying around all the bad feelings and it can really affect your day. But you know what I find really helpful is if you try and look at something always in the positive light. Like if somebody bumps into you, assume it was an accident. If somebody seems like maybe they're being really grouchy or mean, Unless they've said that to you right out and made it really clear, it could be that they're just tired or having a bad day. That's just as possible. And if you assume that, it doesn't really matter if it's true or not, because if they are upset at you, they'll tell you. And if it's somebody who's just a stranger, you're probably never going to see them again. And if you're right that they're just tired or something else going on, then you're not going to be carrying that around all day. And also then, maybe you can make them feel a little better too, because you're not going to, you might react even better to them. But even more importantly, even if they meant something to be hurtful, if you choose not to take it that way, then it doesn't impact your day. You're not carrying that around. Sort of like if you're angry at someone or if you're holding this grudge, you're the one it's affecting. You're the one who's carrying all that around with you, not them. So really, in choosing to look at it and give people the benefit of the doubt, it helps you. And it helps you feel better. Yeah, you might try that. Would you like something to drink? Okay, here. Here, I've got some almond milk here for you. I like this container. <laughs> I'm gonna put it here so you can drink it whenever you want. I was at my other friend's house the other day, and she had a really, really rough day, too. I brushed her hair for her, and she said it made it feel, her feel a little better. Do you like that? Okay. Yeah. I have here my favorite wooden brush. your eyes while I brush your hair. Here. behind you. I like this hairbrush because the bristles sort of massage the scalp.
Do you have to be anywhere soon? No? Okay. Why don't you take a little nap on the couch? And I'm gonna go make us some soup for dinner.